In this video, I'm going to explain the situation where Demophilus might need to be dissolved, how this is achieved and who should do it. Hi, this is Anna and I'm the clinical director and founder of Anna Medical Aesthetics. The vast majority of Demophilus used in UK are non-permanent hyaluronic acid-based fillers that dissolve gradually and naturally due to an enzyme that we all have in our scheme called hyaluronidase. Hyaluronidase or hyalase is also available as a prescription medicine and it can be prescribed by licensed medical professional to quickly dissolve hyaluronic acid demophilus where required. There are generally three situations when an aesthetic injector might need to consider using hyaluronidase. First is where they might have injected too much filler or it has been placed at the wrong depth in the face and the result look unnatural. This happened more commonly with the poorly trained practitioners, especially those with a focus on enhanced needs. The second situation is where poor sterility techniques have been observed by the injecting practitioner and an infection occurs at the injection site or where there is an unexplained reaction to the filler. Both of these are rare but can happen more commonly with injectors who don't specialize in the correct use of a demophilus. Very rare but still situation where the practitioner injects a filler into the blood vessel. This could be a vein or an artery and can be a medical emergency if not spotted and dealt with correctly. Whatever the situation requiring injections to dissolve filler, it's imperative that the practitioner have been specifically trained on how to use hyaluronidase correctly in conjunction with other techniques to ensure the best possible outcome. Only registered healthcare prescribers can prescribe prescription medicines such as hyaluronidase, so we would expressly recommend that you never visit a practitioner for treatment with the cosmetic injectables if they can't prescribe medicine themselves. If you're unsure, always ask the practitioner if they are licensed to prescribe medicine themselves. Medical aesthetic practitioners who specialize in providing cosmetic injectable treatments attend multiple conferences and training courses on techniques to prevent the need for dissolving filler in the first place and have special protocols for the corrective procedures where required. I hope that you have found this brief video useful as many people are unaware of the issue relating to dissolving demophilus and whether their practitioners will be truly trained and capable of dealing with the situation if and when required. If you're interested in having cosmetic injectable treatments and you would like a more comprehensive guide to choosing the right practitioner for you, please just click at the link at the end of this video. The guide is free and no email or phone number is required as it has been written to help you to avoid some of the common mistakes that people make when putting their trust in a provider of products or dermatology treatments.